Do you want to be on the video? Yeah. Do you want to be on the video? Today is a very bad beard day. There's no getting away from it today that my beard is looking pretty rough around the edges. It's splitting in about a billion different places. And it's on days like this when sometimes I think maybe I'll just cut it all off. Not all of it, but go back to having a shorter beard. I haven't quite decided yet. I still don't know why I'm wearing these. But let's talk about this some more. What do you guys think of these glasses? Because to me, I think they're pretty awesome. But let's talk about this. So today I'm having one of those days where the beard just will not play ball with whatever I do, whatever I try. It's just looking a bit, I don't know, I'm just a bit loose. And I mean, it's a good thing in a way. I think I've almost over conditioned the beard. So today I've got a beard butter in and I've also got the chai lemon beard oil. And if you just sort of look, my hands are just gliding through. It's really bouncy. And when it goes like this at the ends, it sort of all splits apart at the ends and goes really, well, just, it feels like it's really thin, but it's not, it's, it's got its thickness. And sometimes I think, mate, sometimes I think that my optimal length of the beard is sort of here, all the way around, just cut it to that sort of length. But we need to talk about some of the things that you can try and do to get rid of the bad beard day. I like the glasses so much that I'm not gonna stop wearing them. But if you don't mind, just don't, you know, don't, don't hit on me too much in the comments below. What can you do if your beard is just looking pretty, sh pretty crap? Let's say we're just gonna bring this down a little bit more. So for me, some of the best things that you can try and do is brush the beard out as much as possible. So you can brush the beard out as much as possible, but there's only so much brushing you can do to get any tangles out. And I've gotten all the tangles out. I mean, there's not a single knot, there's not a single, like almost kink in the beard. Like it's feeling really straight. It's feeling really light. The only problem is it hasn't got much hold today. So what I should have done, instead of applying a butter, and then an oil is I should have applied one of our beard balms and that would have just given it a bit more texture, a bit more feel, given the beard a bit of a heavier product to just sort of sit a bit nicely on my face. I haven't got a mustache wax in today, but the mustache is actually looking pretty cool. I like the way that's looking. That's definitely staying for the long run. I'm definitely growing the mustache out without fail. So in terms of other things that you can try to make the beard look good on a bad beard day, I mean, is like I say, load it with a heavy product. But the beard bar I applied is quite a light, but heavy at the same time, like you can feel it on there. But it's just conditioned it so well that without any styling product, it's looking real messy today. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing, but it's just on days like this, you suddenly realize how much upkeep it is to keep a long beard in check. Now I guess with any length of beard, you can have good and bad beard days. Not you can have good or bad hair days. However, the reason I think the beard is a bit today is because when I jumped out the shower, I dried the beard and I put absolutely no product in. At least not immediately. The baby was choking on some cucumber. I was getting called to come downstairs. He was fine. It was. He was fine, he was just being a typical baby. But I forgot to put product in for ages after that, maybe a good 20, 25 minutes. And by that time, I think the beard had just frizzed out. It probably wasn't fully dry. The hair dryer sort of blitzed the, the beard and you know, sort of done its thing, but it left a bit of moisture on there. The weather's a lot warmer today in the UK. I mean, like I went out in a t-shirt. I think there's a lot of factors today that have made my beard feel a little bit worse than maybe some other days. I mean, it's not feeling bad. Like, don't get me wrong, it's feeling really nice. Like, I could stroke this beard all day long. But in terms of a style point, I kind of just want it to fall in neatly. No matter what I do, it's not gonna happen today. So the things you can do, like we said, you can brush the beard, load it with a good product, uh, a heavier product, a styling product and you just need to make sure that you're doing the right things at the right time. So once you've washed the beard or had a shower, 
give it some oil, then use the hair dryer, then put some conditioning product maybe or a styling product in at that point, work it in maybe with the hair dryer on a cooler setting to hold it in place. I did none of that today and that has sort of resulted in a messy beard day. But guys, let me know what you do if you had a if you have a bad beard day. Like what do you do? Do you do you hide away from everyone? Do you trim, shave? I know people have done that, just shave the beard off because you can't be bothered with the hassle. What sort of products you use? Do you change up your routine? Let me know in the comments below and I will thank you for watching today. It's been my pleasure. I appreciate all your time and attention. Sorry if you can hear sort of, it's the pug. Let's get her. So both of us are gonna thank you for your time and attention today. If you enjoyed watching, just hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe and we'll see you next time, guys. Goodbye.